quite frankly, I'm feeling the same way, Box. Oh, she just woke up. She's kind of mad that I woke her up. But I just wanted to kind of tell you what's going on. I was going to film outside, but of course, the guy with the leaf blower is just going nuts out there. Last night, I... <laughs> I was just so teary and sad and I just had to throw myself a little pity party. If anybody else is on the job search, you can probably relate. My sister, I feel like I always say her little quotes on here, but she said something that really stuck with me. And what she said was, you're just being a slingshot right now. You're being pulled back because you're gonna be let go and go on some adventure greater than you would have ever thought you're about to leap forward and that really resonated with me i needed that last night i think i've just been so focused on job searching and the sort of getting my career started that i haven't really done anything else and i haven't really done anything for myself so I think that's what I'm gonna do today. I've been wanting to make some little pottery. I don't know if they have these little things everywhere else, but we have this studio called All Fired Up where you can paint your own pottery. You don't make the pottery, but you can paint it. I love painting. I love little crafty things. So I think that's a great idea for me to get out of the house today and try something new. I'm gonna go do that. Hopefully it turns my day around. Let's have a good day. I sent all my cover letters and my CVs out to the jobs that I'm applying for and I've gone full L Woods. Put these cute little stickers on all of them, especially for their pediatrics jobs. Good stuff. I think this will work. Set me apart a little bit. Wendy's with mom, just dropped her off, and now we're on our way. Oh 
Oh my gosh, guys, I just, I found a dog. I don't know what to do. He just crossed the street. A little update. I got the dog and we are headed to the Humane Society. She's so cute. This is definitely not how I saw my day going, but I found this cute little pup on the side of the road and he was crossing a really busy road near my house and I already checked her collar. I don't know her name, but I've been calling her Buddy or Caroline for some reason. But cars were whizzing past her. She's super sweet. She jumped in my car right away and we just got to the Humane Society. So I'm hoping they can find her family, but if not, I am going to be very close to keeping her because she's so cute. We just went to one animal shelter and they told us to go to another one. They scanned her for chips and everything, but we're just having a good time. We're going to go to the other shelter and see what they say. Buddy! Update number 5010. I just dropped the little pup off at a different animal shelter, the one that the other one told me to send her to, just because it was a little bit closer to where I found her, and then it just makes it more likely that the owners will find her. She was just so sweet though. I am absolutely in love with her. I really hope that she finds her family, because if that was my dog, I would be heartbroken. She didn't bark or anything. She didn't try to bite me. She was just a perfect dog. I opened the window a little bit for her and she had her little head hanging out. She had her tail wagging. She was very stinky. She smelled like absolute booty hole, but what a little princess. She was so cute. That honestly made my day. I was having a super bad day yesterday, just a super teary day. Nothing particularly happened. I was just in a bad mood. So I had planned to go to my little painting adventure today, but God said, you know what? Taylor was in a bad mood yesterday. You know what will cheer her up? Dogs. So that was my day. Maybe we'll do painting another day, but just got to the grocery store, get some good grocery ingredients and make some dinner. I'm thinking also some red wine treat tonight. That could be exceptional with some ice cream. Still a good day. So as you all probably know already, my plans for yesterday went a little bit awry with finding the little pup on the side of the road and everything. Speaking of which, everybody's working really hard to find her owners. I shared it on Facebook and the animal shelter also shared her post on Facebook. It's already gotten probably like 200 shares. So fingers crossed that she finds her home because she was so sweet. I loved her so much. One of the best dogs I've ever met. <clears throat> Even John loved her and he's in Philadelphia. So <laughs> anyways, she just stole everybody's hearts. Back to today though. I got up and I edited my last video, checked my applications and everything. And now I'm about to get ready. Me and mom are going to the farmer's market because it's Friday. I'm super excited today they have like an apple festival so everything is apple themed in our favorite little bakery i'll try to figure out their names i actually don't know the name of the bakery but i'll get that today it's where we always get the bread that we get and then the pumpkin spice muffins the pumpkin roll and everything i'll try to link that below but i'm so excited they're gonna have an old-fashioned cider press and everything so it should be a good day You can have it. She's like, what is this? It's for you. <laughs> we just got our dough beans. I haven't tried it yet. Maybe we'll do a little taste test, Mom. I'm excited. I, oh God, that sounds terrible. I am on a mission to find the best white chocolate pumpkin spice oat milk latte or almond milk the one at coffee bar in ardmore pennsylvania that one's number one so far starbucks is actually number two I'm usually not a huge fan of starbucks but we'll see how this one is they gave wendy this little 
pup cup. It's kind of like the Starbucks puppuccino, but she won't eat it. She eats every kind of human food, begs for it every night, but they give her a little tree and she doesn't want it. She's like, what is it? No such luck. So perfect. We just got our oat milk lattes. Cheers. Cheers to <laughs> the weekend. Woo! Mmm! <laughs> mmm! Mm. Bailey's missing. Here, Bailey. <laughs> Here, Bailey. Have, have a taste. Cheers. I'd say this is pretty good. Mmm. What'd you get? I always get. An oat milk or almond milk latte with one pie, <laughs> one pump of pumpkin spice and one pump of white chocolate. Yeah, so it's so good. Get out of here. <laughs> You'd like it because it's so sweet. Great. Now you got two women up in our name. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hear you. Oh my god. So is anybody else? I'm dead. <laughs> They'll have. Okay, I'm gonna. We're gonna leave here in a little bit. I'm gonna give what you these checks. He said, "Good luck." And if they got don't, two women if they in the don't building come, today. <laughs> bring them back to me because I'll drop them in the middle. I had to come talk. Because I'll be back in a little bit. I had to come talk. Don't y'all get to run? I can't get you out of She's talking to Bailey now. You know how that goes. <laughs> She's in Richmond. Not gonna happen today. I appreciate that they have the 20 ounce and not just the like 12 ounce like the other one. Yeah, that's just weird. <laughs> because I need a lot of well, let's Let's tell them that. What? At the other one? Yeah. Okay, I'm all Joe Bean. Hmm? Joe Bean. Where are we going, Mom? Shopping. Vista work. Huh? I said hasta la vista work. Hasta la vista. <laughs> I'd like to do more than that. <laughs> <laughs> bakery this morning. <laughs> we got love these. The we do. We got these pumpkin cheesecake muffins like we got last week. And then we also got these raspberry cheesecake muffins this week and we're so excited to try them. Mm -hmm. Mom already gave a bunch to the guys, didn't you? Mm -hmm. And they liked them. But not as much as we like them. <laughs> It's Saturday about noon. Me and mom are headed to the winery later, so making a cute little healthy snack to fill us up so we don't die at the winery. Good stuff. And this is the well, best peanut butter ever. Um, I don't know. It's just the fresh ground peanut butter from uh -huh. Fresh Market. 
It's so good. How good is the peanut butter? It's great. 10 out of 10 or what is the? 10 out of 10 fresh market, love it. Nice. I also painted my nails last night and it's, I'll go get it in a second, but it's this like very light gold, almost kind of like a rosy gold, but it's very neutral and I love it. It might be my holiday color. So very pleased. I'm wearing my free people tank, some Abercrombie jeans. A little flare if you can see them and I'm wearing this jacket that I'm absolutely in love with at the outfit for the day fit check what are you wearing mom my nice new, shirt my new shoes with my nice white socks nice where are the shoes from um Culver's white cool where are the jeans from um Kim Gravel Awesome, and where's your shirt from? Discount Divas. Oh baby, you should be a spokesperson for Discount Divas. I should, shouldn't I? Discount Divas, if you're watching this, hire her. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to know what for Taylor gave. She's not watching. I told her, she's like, okay, now I don't feel so bad. Our neighbor, she's got little Yorkie puppies. Just one did they get, or did they get two? All right, well, we're on our way to drop the trash off and then we're gonna go try Hickory Hills Winery. What kind of wine are you gonna get, Mom? White. Rosé. Heard it here first. Um, trash run. Trash run. Nothing I love more. I know, me either. Got to the winery and we're doing our little wine tasting. <laughs> Good. But how many did they give us? We got eight. Eight little samples. So I'm going to taste all of them. Mom likes... Mm. I'm not going to do that. What are you having wine? Mm. Right. How this little place works is you... They give you this little glass and it was $14 <laughs> for the whole tasting and then at the very end you can decide if you want to keep the glass or you can turn it back in and get $5 back. So we can price. Okay. <laughs> Which one are you going to try first? I don't know. I'm missing a picture of it to take it So cute. And then I'll show you later, but they have this cute little wolf sign. It's so cute. Take your time. There. Okay. <laughs> so we're trying number one. We're not sure what it is because we didn't do the QR code. But I can do that. We'll see. It's... What kind of smell does it have? I don't know, we need Bailey for the wine. She's the at wine expert. It's like in that movie with Tina Fey and Amy Fuller, and she's like, what does it smell like? And she said, grapes. <laughs> and he's like, no. This wine uses cookies. Ooh. Oh, wait. This wine, this site. <laughs> Full pond. Okay. What are we going to cheers to? White wine with Chardonnay with a touch of Vidal Blanc. Mm, full pond. That's why it's called full pond. Because it's like fish. Okay. You think? Probably so. What are you going to cheers to? <laughs> <laughs> cheers to Girls Day Out. Happy Halloween. <laughs> I like it. Do you? Mm. I like it for a white. I like a dry white. Yeah. I don't like sweet. Not me. Here is their little list. This is the first one we tried. The full pond. Sunset. Ooh, babe. Nice. Smile. 
round on number two. We gave number one a six out of ten, both of us. It is the ocean. I did it. I did it. I forgot. Mom's getting the information for the next one. Oh, mine's fizzing. Jeez. Oh, boy. It's two. This one is called. Okay. It's just a regular Chardonnay. This one is called Chardonnay. It's a smooth, dry, white wine. Oh, it's probably just the order of these. Do you think? One, two, three, yeah. four, five, six, yeah. seven, eight, oh, nine. Grilled tuna, tuna, and pork tenderloin. Yeah. Well, it takes so much money to find these kind of places. I can't keep up. I also feel better about sent it to sent it to more Anna. Expensive wine. Yeah, Virginia wine. Virginia wine. Shout out Anna Pendleton. We're trying it. <laughs> Hickory Hill. Hickory Hill. Sponsor us. <laughs> Did you try it? Mm -mm, you gotta go. That's how they do. They do. To see the aroma. <laughs> <laughs> We're so extra. <laughs> Why not? I like it. I think I like the first one better, though. I kind of think we might have been down this road for our house for some reason, but this stuff was always here. Our house that we grew up in? Yeah. Oh, wow. Mm. Did you like this one? I didn't like this one as much as the first one. Really? I was the other way. I liked the... Hmm. What? You give this one. What is your rating? Five. Five. You liked it better. You can't give it a less rating. You want to decrease this mm. the first one's mm. rating, mm. and then do this one a six? No. You would think this one is a six point five or a seven, or an eight. Do a seven. Seven. I think maybe it's about equal for me. Maybe. I know I got six more of it. <laughs> six and seven. You don't like them dry, but I like this one. This no, is I my like favorite. Dry. Favorite number three. so far. Number three is a keeper. Mist. Off dry stainless steel Vidal Blanc Chard. Mist. I can see it mist out here in the morning. <laughs> mist in the morning. It sounds like a romantic novel. <laughs> oh god. Nicholas Sparks. <laughs> is this the setting of your next book? <laughs> this is really good. It's a good one. I like it. Yeah. This is a good one. Did you like it too or not? Yeah, no, I like don't. this one. I do like this one. I like this one as much as I like the first one. Okay, I like, I like the, the second one the least. Yeah. That was my least favorite. I like this one the best. Which one is this for? Mm -hmm. Oh, we're going on to the reds. I didn't finish my list. Oh, I like that one. That was, that's my favorite right there. I like that one too. What was your rating of mist? Ten. Okay, wow. <laughs> So out of far. The ballpark. I'm going for that, that one. was a seven of the out of ten for me. For the whites, that was better for me. Four? Yep. For him, you see? spill these. Oh, I did. Look at mine. Oh, mine's fizzing too. Yeah. I guess it's because it's fermented. Yeah. Let it breathe. <laughs> Let it breathe. That's why I breathe. Got it everywhere. Bailey, you're missing out. We miss you if you're watching this. <laughs> Here's to Bales. Okay, are we gonna cheers this one to Bales? Who's you with? Morgan? Bailey, Morgan, Sarah, and Sarah. Oh! Hi, girls. The cute boys are there. <laughs> Just saying. So, me and Taylor are getting ready for them. <laughs> cheers. Should we ben. give them some wine when they come in? <laughs> for trick or treating. <laughs> Like this one at all. Uh, you can definitely tell it's like the oak aged one. Yeah. This one's oh this one's 2014 Cab Sap Dry French. Oh no, this one's kind of wrong. French oak aged Cab Sap. Let's do a little. I'm not as much of a fan of the oaky. I'm not either. And that's funny because we should be. It's Cabernet Franc. Franc. Is a French oak aged, yep. Dry red wine with subtle aromas of black pepper with hints of red fruit, raspberries, and cherries. Wendy's pot roast. Who is Wendy? Our dog? We should like this. Or grilled chicken. Mm -hmm. Pasta. Mm -hmm. I don't like that one. Reds always go with pasta. I know, but I don't I like it. That's like it. Thing. Yeah. But I Except don't like this like, one. I feel like seafood pasta is well, like a seafood you're supposed to pair with all your Yeah. <laughs> I don't like this I one. Don't. Mm -mm. This one would not 
not do it for me. Not my face. <laughs> What's your rating? That's not all I like to too bad. Zero. <laughs> okay, wow. Did not like that one. No. Zero out of ten. I'll give that one a five out of ten. I wasn't actually thrilled with that. I don't like the taste of it at all. <laughs> no thanks. Negative rating from mom. I do not like steak portabella mushroom steak. Did we mention steak? <laughs> <clears throat> Oh yeah, so this one, we need some steak with it. Bring on the steak. Let's go to Fresh Market. So yeah, this just smells sweeter. If you smell the oak, I can smell the oak. Yeah. And see, that turns me off for some reason. I like oak flowers though. <laughs> just don't like to drink it. Mm -mm. What's the difference between this one and the other one? What's your rating? Um, Is it better or worse than the last one? Probably zero out of ten. Yeah, I don't like it. <laughs> Mom doesn't like red. This was the Wendy's pot roast one that went before that. Four. I'm going to give this one... Look at this one a six out of ten. I still like the first one the best, I think. This is the one with pot roast, pot roast and grilled chicken. Oh no, I, I think the mist is still my favorite. I like that. I liked that one too. <laughs> We're lucky that one's the cheapest. <laughs> <laughs> What's the chances of that? It shows what kind of taste we have. Cheap. Yeah. <laughs> yep. There we go. What were we just talking about? And we said no. So I used to like that $5 Aldi wine. <laughs> Bales wish you were here. You're missing out on all the fun. <laughs> At Hickory Hill Vineyards. Okay, Myra. Manita, Virginia. Moira. <laughs> Fruit wine. <laughs> this kind is nasty though. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like the oak ones. I just I don't either. I don't either. <laughs> I know it's getting chilly. Okay, well mom didn't like that one. We didn't no. get to try country red number six. That must be the best because it's sold out. Rosebud? Seven. Only we really knocked these out. <laughs> Thinking we had so many. Now there's a bee by my camera. Dead. <laughs> Take a picture. They all kind of fizz. It's because they're cooled and then they come out, I think. Okay, this is the rose. This is red bud. Oh, that one a silver ribbon. Look. Oh, nice. Silver ribbon for this one. Silver ribbon. Must be good. <laughs> sweet, semi sweet, dark rose. Shark. It's from Chardonnay and Cabernet, strawberry, raspberry, aromas, soft cheeses, <gasps> feta cheese, or frozen strawberries as ice cubes for sipping. Ooh, that's a good idea. <laughs> Too busy reading. Well, it kind of got confusing because we skipped six. Yes. Mm, smells good. Yeah, it does. The aroma is wonderful. So it tastes as wonderful as it smells. I think they're right, like strawberries. I don't know if I'm convincing cheers. myself. Yeah. <laughs> what are we cheersing this one to? Your decision this time. Okay. Let's cheers to John. Okay, to John. <laughs> Happy Halloween. Happy Chewbacca. Halloween, John. <laughs> Chewbacca. That's what he was for Halloween. Oh. I like this one. Mm hmm. It's like a little sweet, but it's not bad. No, I like this one too. It's sweeter. Mm hmm. I'm usually not one for sweet, but this one is like a I'm not usually sweet. for a Merlot either, and that's a, it says a Merlot blend. I'm surprised. Yeah, I like this one too. Mm -hmm. I do like that one. I do too. I think that one would be good with like frozen fruit in it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And a charcuterie board. I'd drink that with a charcuterie board in a heartbeat. I'm going to give that one a 7 out of 10 too. I'd say 8 out of 10. Oh, wow. So that one's better than any of your other ones. Oh no, you like mist. You yeah, that I like mist. <laughs> mist is it. This is a close second though to that, I'm gonna say. We can do it, I'm saying, and we like it. All right, sunset. Number eight. It pairs well with all of our favorite foods. Breakfast foods and cheesecake. <laughs> Pop and mini cheesecake. Yeah. Ooh, it smells good.
What is this one? Sweet? Mom's gonna like this one. I don't know. The aroma doesn't do much for me. Reds always have a good aroma. Let's say oak. Okay, what do you think? Does it smell good to you? Smells like wine. <laughs> nope, not the one for me. You don't like it too sweet? I don't like it. I mean, it's probably, I mean, it's, I mean, right. it's fine, but I wouldn't get it. No. I don't like the smell. It's like a, probably one of my least favorites. What's your rating of Sunset? I mean, it's all right. I wouldn't give it maybe a six. Oh, that's pretty high for you. <laughs> <laughs> we forgot to cheers for this one. What are we going to cheers to? Boopy. Oh my God, I'm going to have to cut that out. Cheers to puppies <laughs> and good men. <laughs> Never sacrifice anything for your career or a man. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you for coming to her TED Talk. <laughs> no more wine for you. <laughs> Number nine, the last one. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this one's smoking. It's a sizzler. Sweet red sail, sweet Bordeaux blend. I don't think I've ever had a sweet red. So. Pairings, itchy, but. Blue cheese, figs, and chocolate. I could pair it with chocolate, that's for sure. <laughs> Our, does it go for, with um, Reese's Fast Break? Take five. <laughs> Take five. Take that's five. it. Aren't those good? That's what it is. Aren't they good? <laughs> they are good. One of those. I don't want to watch that nasty Cashies. show again tonight, though. That's good. <laughs> Mom doesn't like you. <laughs> she thinks it's a scary show. <sighs> what are you smelling? It makes I me smell scared of people. <laughs> yeah, I do too. I do too. I like that one actually. I do too. That's a sweet, sweet red. red. Cause I think I like the, I like mist the best. So I'll give that one an eight. <laughs> that one got the highest rating. So mist number three is the best. Yep. We From like Hickory that. Hills. Yep. <laughs> From your local wine experts. But I did like sweet red sale also. <laughs> adventures for the day <laughs> what are you doing <laughs>